Hey, it's David Rosen, and now we're going to talk about does smell sell? More millionaires are made through real estate through any other means. My name is David Rosen, and I'm one of the top 100 real estate brokers in New York City. This is my video blog. The smell sell. It's good when things smell good, isn't it? But smells are complex. Flowers naturally have lovely fragrances that attract bees and birds and people. Um, when you go into a store, sometimes you know they'll have a scented candle or incense or uh, uh, food items. Cinnabon is a very famous smell we can all think about. But when you're selling real estate, I want to tell you something that's a bit contrarian. Sell, smell does not sell real estate. Sellers should avoid manipulating smells. And there was a great Wall Street Journal article about this in 2014. It's behind the paywall. I can't post it. But basically, um, uh, there's a few risks with smells. Uh, it creates a short-term effect, but it could do the following things. It could seem gimmicky. You know, selling real estate for hundreds of thousands, if not millions of dollars is not selling Cinnabon. It can miss the mark. I mean, some people like the smell of certain colognes or perfumes or flowers or candles and some people don't and all people are different. You want to cast the widest net possible and attract the best possible price. To do that, you want to be neutral. What we talk about is uh, presenting yourself like a museum or like a hotel, neither of which are defined by strong smells. Uh, number three, it distracts. If there's a beautiful cookie smell, I'm not thinking, God, I better pay full price. I'm desperate to buy this house or that couple over there is going to do it. I'm thinking about cookies. Smell doesn't help sell homes. And, and, and on that last subject, four, it actually can make people either disgusted, right, or complacent. They feel comfortable. They feel great. Guess what? You're selling a home. It's not your job to make the buyer feel comfortable and great. To make the job, your job is to make the buyer feel like they better sign a contract tomorrow or they're going to lose the home. Smells don't do that. So I know that's not what most people think and talk about, but if you want to sell a home for top dollar, the way I sell homes for top dollar, don't rely on smell. And if you have any further questions about that, you can call me, email me, message me, text me. I'll be happy to talk. Thanks.